Hello. Hopefully this works. I don't know. Um, hello. <laughs> I'm on a couch right now. Um, nothing's wrong. I'm fine. Do I have a smudge? Maybe not. Um, I'm good. I'm just a little tired and I'm extremely lazy. <laughs> um, hey, what's up? So I made a different video and the audio was horrible where it sounded like I lived in a pineapple under the sea, but I don't. Hello, not for you. Excuse me, ma'am. Take a seat. Take a seat. Oh, damn. I love jokes. So now here we are making this video. What's this video about? I can't tell you because I don't know. <laughs> I thought that I would just chat with you as I'm being lit by my laptop screen. My laptop, I'm on msn.com and um, 30 worst reviewed cruises. <laughs> Let's see. To me, a cruise sounds like hell on water because i have horrible motion sickness and also um you're trapped with all those people surrounded by sharks i mean <laughs> what are you gonna do I'm gonna sit down. i wasn't here last week i mean i was here but so what happened was i was editing a video of the dogs playing outside it was adorable and, um, yeah, I got like 20, 30 minutes into editing where suddenly everything just kind of like stopped working. And then they're like, file is corrupt. And I wasn't sure if that was the proper verb tense or if it should have been corrupted. But they said corrupt. But, you know, humans write the code. You don't have to have perfect grammar to be a coder. You know what I'm saying? I live somewhere else now. The past, what, six months, I lived with my parents. Mm -hmm. Now I'm here, and uh, Marty is sleeping down on the floor. Otherwise, she would be excited to say hello. But it is 9.15 p.m. <laughs> you know, she's got to get her beauty rest. I got this blanket two years ago for Christmas. My parents got it for me. It's very soft. Am I even touching the mic? I don't know. <laughs> so here's something which just got resolved right now. Okay, so I got my internet installed on Friday. And I'm filming this on a Monday. So when I signed up for my internet, which was about two weeks before the internet was installed, the woman that I spoke to over the phone was like, okay, we need for you to give us a username and a password and you can easily change this by calling into tech support and uh, giving them your updated information but just for the time being we just need a temporary one so I thought okay no big deal I'll give you a really lazy username and an even lazier password so they set me up with the internet and of course they had the lazy username and the lazy password and so I called up tech support and I said hey there um, I have a very lazy username and an even lazier password, and I would like to change it to a more interesting username and a more complicated password. And they said, okay, let's do it. So this dude that I'm talking to is all like, la 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 la, okay, it's changed. And so I go on my computer, and I look at my internet, and it still has the old stuff. And I said, um, it's not changed, it's still the old way. And he's like, well, it'll take about 24 hours to take effect. And I said, okay, that's fun. So then we hung up and I'm like, cool. 24 hours pass and I check my internet and it's still the same thing. And I'm like, okay, well, that's freaking stupid. So then I called tech support again and I talked to a different guy and he's all like, hey, I can help you change your username and password. What do you want me to change it to? 
So then I tell him the exact same thing that I told the first guy. And he's like, okay, it's fixed. You'll see it changed in about four hours. And I said, okay, that sounds good. So then four hours later, nothing has changed. And I'm like, well, that's stupid. It really is. So then I think maybe in 24 hours it'll change. So, you know, I just let it go. I let it do its thing. So I check my username and password again over 24 hours later and nothing has changed. And at this point, I'm just getting pretty darn frustrated because what is going on? Please help me. So then I decide tonight to call again. And this time a woman answered and I'm like, oh, thank God. So I tell her the exact same thing, that I have a temporary username and a temporary password, and I have tried multiple times to have it changed, and they keep saying that it's changed, but it's not changed. So she looks me up in the system, and she says, you're telling me that someone told you that things changed? And I said, yes, I've had two guys tell me that they have changed my username and password, and that I just have to wait until it takes effect. And then she says, no. <laughs> That didn't happen. Nothing has changed. And I said, well, that's fantastic. So then she tells me that she'll take care of it. So after about 10 minutes, she was very frustrated. Not with me. She was frustrated that it was just being really annoying. And then she finally figured something out. She's like, oh my God, there it is. And then she's like, do, 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 do. She's like, did that work? And I'm like, oh, let me check my internet. And I did. And I said, it did work. And she's like, oh, okay. No, you have to check a different device. Make sure that works. So I'm like, and I did, and it worked. And I said, oh my God, it worked. She's like, oh my God, it worked. <laughs> so before she hung up, she asked me if there's anything else that she could do for me. And there was really nothing else because she took care of business. I mean, she solved my problem. So I told her that I have nothing else that I need for her to do, but I just really appreciated her helping me because she's the only one who actually took the time to do it instead of just saying that they were going to do it or saying that it will happen, just you have to have patience. <laughs> I just really appreciated it because I hate it when um, people don't actually follow through. Like, it really annoys me. And she followed through. And it was a slam dunk. <laughs> These are some basketball references. Thank you. Can we talk about Aunt Becky? What the hell happened there? You guys, I'm on Olivia Jade's YouTube channel and I went to her about section and it says, Hi everyone, I'm Olivia Jade and my channel is https colon slash slash www.youtube.com slash user slash Olivia Jade Beauty. Why did, why would you do that? We're on your channel. Why are you doing that? I was going to have such a better video than this, but then the audio is all goofed up. That sucks. So next week's video is going to be better than this. Um, but hopefully you still... I don't know if you enjoyed this. <laughs> I don't have a clue. <laughs>